Yo, what's going on, BJOE? And also to the folks out there on YouTube, I'm gonna try something a little different today. I've got my trusty Smith & Wesson m and in 40 caliber that I'm gonna do the dot torture test. And basically they said this is a little drill that helps you to improve your accuracy. So I'm gonna definitely give it a shot today. And on some of the drills, it says that you have to utilize um, drawing from the holster. I'm um, actually simulate drawing for the holster. I know it's not the same thing, so don't come down on me. But I just wanted to give this a little shot and give it a little try today. The reason I'm not gonna draw for the holster is because I actually got my got my Sig Sar P229 and 40 cal on me on my holster, and I don't like going through the whole thing of taking it off in order to um, to do this test with the Smith uh, Smith and Wessons. So let's see how it goes. Let's check it out.
I just got through doing the dot torture chest with my Smith & Wesson 40 cal and I actually enjoyed it. I don't normally do that when I come to the wreck, the little drills and stuff like that, but I think I'm going to get a little more into that because it did feel good doing something different than just a regular shooting at a target standing there and not having any sort of uh, pressure. Even though I know you noticed I was moving slow as molasses <laughs> while I was going through it and I can see where this would actually help with accuracy. So. I, gives it, I definitely give it a thumbs up in realms of something new and something different for myself because I need to get a little more out of my comfort zone in order to improve, improve, my, um, improve my accuracy and so forth. But I definitely enjoy doing it and I'm going to see what other, what, other, um, what other ideas that are out there in, that, in order to help me improve my accuracy. So if you got anything, let me know. I'm all ears, all right? So this is Jeffrey Howell, Black Gun Owners in Education. Peace out, YouTube. Peace out, BJOE. You have a good one. See you out at the range.